welcome back guys so what we'll be doing in this video right now is a tissue a bad dream weaver i will just launch an html page for us to explain what i'll be showing you this is the work environment right now you might not be familiar with this dream weaver cxs if you've not been using it before but that is step aside what I want to be explaining to you right now is this theory or this four element here one we have the code we have the split we have the design and the live view these are three four different views in Dreamweaver which developers use during the course of any app development this is the code view the code environment where every coding has to be done and this is a split view a division of code view and the design view here whatever you're writing in here will also indicate right here on the design view that is to show you that you can be working and be previewing right away on this side and at the same time you can decide to work on your design view and preview behind to see the codes it's generating and if you're working probably you've designed something and you want to see it, how it's going to look on the browser then the live view becomes handy this live view shows you exactly how this is going to render in the browser for you to see so right now we are seeing it just the way you're going to see it in any browser so this live view is used to preview our work live to see how it's going to look like or you can rather go through this process of reviewing in any of your browsers you have installed in your systems so for now what I'll be showing you is just how this code view split view and design view differs talking about the code view professionals can work here design the entire page from here without ever going to the design view to see how it's looking because they already have a, a pre-knowledge of what is going to be coming up as soon as you render it to the browser but for novice which we are right now at this point we're going to be doing it viewing it from different sides we we'll use the split view we we'll use the design view we'll the live view as we go along because for every single step we want to be undertaking we want to see how it's affecting our job so we'll be using splits and code view most of the time why the design view we can use we can render to our browser to see how it's going to look in terms of the design view itself but right now it doesn't really matter if i decide to insert probably a table here of about three columns there's a three render so three by three what we have here right now is something that's already designed so if you go back to code view this is the code generated for those table you already see so i have to tell you that even if you decide to encode this table from this side if you go to the split view you see how it's rendering your design view and you can decide to view it from what your your design view as the case may be so it all depends on whoever is trying to learn the course and how you can follow along with these three fixtures these are your your tools you'll be using as this course progresses so see you in the next video where we'll be talking about how to kickstart our website see you